Okay, guys, so I'm quickly going to show you how to render this uh, part. So we already make this. So we're going to go over here to render. And you can see that we'll have new controls. Uh, in this case, yours would not look like this. Mine looks like this because I already played with some of the settings. But to change some of the color background before you render your image, uh, you can go over here to uh, this scene settings. And you can change your color over here. Select a different color if you want, right? Whatever solid color you want. You can select it, click apply, and it will change it. So you can do whichever one you like, All right? Click OK, and then close it. Or you can change different environment libraries, different type of lights that you would like this to have. There are some presets already like this ones as well. So we can drag this this uh field as well. Download it. Sometimes you can download it. I guess my I can't right now because of my connection. But you can do some of those, right? Or there's a solid color like an environment, right? This is probably how it looks like for you before. So all we're gonna be doing right now is gonna go over here to render. You're gonna click on render. And it usually depends on your computer, right? Because this is this depends on your internal the settings of your computer, how fast it is, how much processing can do for images. Uh, we'll go to either one of these ones. We'll go to custom or or web. No, it doesn't really matter. Uh, let's just do web. Let's do this one. And we'll do cloud render and render quality standard. Make sure you click those, and we'll click on render. Once you click render, you know, it will produce something over here, like this image is right here. So the ones that I had before. Um, and they will take you, depending on your computer, it could take you, you know, somewhere between 10 minutes to probably more. It just depends on your computer once again. So uh, be sure to, um, to make sure that your computer is able to do this. You can see I can move some things around here in render and it will change you know, some of my image. Uh, I can also do in canvas render over here where it will render this image here in this view to make it to make it look realistic. That's essentially what it is doing here. But you know, the render that will be running, once it runs, it will produce this once in the bottom, right? Which then you can export. So I click one of those. Uh, it might do it because like for some of you, for some of you, it might not because you know, it, it varies on your, your settings, right? So it's taking a while to open, you know, it's just, just on your settings on the computer. So let's say this is my image that I have that I want to export. So I'm going to go here to download and I can download as a transparent background, right? Or uh, or not, in this case, I want the, the full green screen to come in the back. So download as image as PNG or JPEG or whichever one, and this will download to your computer and you can use that image. So the next thing that we'll do is we're going to go to our drawing. We have already made our drawing. So I'm going to go to insert image. And I'm going to look at look for that image in my computer. The ones that I already made before. So in the case was this one open. And I'm going to place it here. OK. And then I can resize this one to be bigger. All right, you can something around here, and then we'll just save this as you know, uh, render image. So this will be render picture or render of assembly, right? Or whatever it is. So that way, you will have all of your uh, main parts plus you know, the render picture. So we're gonna start including render pictures if your computer is able to do it. If your computer cannot do this, no, don't worry. That's fine. Um, just try to add the just write a note that you, your computer is not able to do it. But I think most computers should be able to give it enough time. So do not, you know, do not uh, lose hope if your computer can't do this. So that's pretty much for this one. We'll do the same thing for the other one. So that's it. I'll see you guys in the next video.